the fig way. Got a special for you today. That's right, whole street. Pomona, California. Yeah, let's check it out. So obviously, we out here checking out another workshop in the Tesla factory, seeing what kind of vehicles they're producing out here. So as my assessment, I've been able to determine that these are Model 3s, not quite Cybertrucks. Model 3s though, they're definitely in the family. Now you might say some of these Model 3s belong out there in Cybertruck land, and I agree, but you know what's different about these Model 3s? gonna see so I left this part in here for everybody out here that just you know be thinking this is something that it's not <laughs> as you can see <laughs> I'm not gonna lie when Tiger first heard about this and then when I started to do the voiceover I looked at this and I was like man you know what I mean I don't think that it should be edited out because people think that this is like easy or this is like, uh, you know, you can just hop out here and do it. And I don't really recommend that because there are a lot of people out here that are serious. They are excessive and they don't be playing about nothing that they do. There are different kinds of workshop employees. You dig what I'm saying? So just for me to you, you know, you got to make sure you watch your surroundings, make sure that things like this don't happen. This happened early as well, so I left it in here just as a, a warning that, you know, you got to be able to make sure that basically you can recover, you know what I mean? Sometimes this could have been a lost situation. Again, this is a whole different city. I don't even know what's going on, you know, I'm new to it, so you just got to make sure that you keep your keep your bearings ahead of you keep your bearings you got to keep your bearings got to keep your head focused keep your eyes straight head in the game keep your head in the game so this part right here again it's different so I didn't want to approach it the same way I wanted to give it a little bit of flair of its own what I was seeing after a little bit of research, can't just go out there and not have no homework done. Gotta do a little bit of research, you dig what I'm saying? Because again, this is not no situation like that where it's just all positive. You know what I mean? Something can't go wrong. And again, as we just saw, it's minor, but something did go wrong. So you gotta be able to, to adjust again. But what I was seeing out here was more so like groups. But I don't know how they function. I don't know if they like, you know what I mean? If it's like a whole cooperation or it, it's incorporated. I don't know if everybody's together. I don't know if everybody's separate. I really don't know. So what you gotta do is not inquire, but you gotta observe. You gotta pay attention. You gotta see what's going on. You gotta go with the flow. You gotta be able to control the flow a little bit as well. You know what I mean? It takes some finesse to be able to do the things that you see here done. And like I was saying, you know, if things do happen, if things do arise, you got to be able to be quick. You got to act on your feet. So this is one of them streets, Clark. Might see Clark Street again. Clark Street was obviously popping because this is where the quartet was. I was like, okay, we're about to go see where all these, these Model 3s. About to go see where the Model 3s is going because I really didn't know. I'm like, are they moving to a different block? Because maybe that one was like undersaturated. Maybe it wasn't getting no play or nothing. So I'm like, all right. But one thing I will say about these out here, these Model 3s out here, yo, they do not let you see them. Like when you get up close, they got like this mechanism that automatically triggers. Like they don't even gotta see it, they could just feel it. It's like a magnetic bond in their skin. It's wild. I'm like, what is going on? I tried to get the best photos for you guys, but you're gonna see. Come check it out.
come check it out. And what I've noticed is, is minimal lighting out here on Hull Street. So you got to really pull up so you can get the full glimpse and full glare of what you what you trying to partake in, what you want to see. Look at that. Instant hand up. I'm like, what is going on? But you know what this started to think? I'm like, oh, dang, did I just cause a war? Are they going the same way towards where the other ones was going? Is it going to be a Model 3 battle? Because, again, I don't know this area. So I'm like, dang, I hope I didn't create no war. It's like, man, look, right there on that corner. And the other Model 3s is on the other corner. So at this point, it's just up. It's just like, what's going to go on? I don't know. I was like, dang, should I go warn them? Then I was like, nah, you got to watch and see what happens because that's real life. You know what I mean? Sometime a leopard will go kill. We'll go get his food. We'll go hunt. We'll go bring back the spoils. Next thing you know, that hyena walk in his den out of nowhere. Hyena come take that food. You know, it's up to that leopard to get that food back. But then, sometimes, just sometimes, there was a lion walking the whole time. And that lion just <laughs> got a whiff. Next thing you know, uh-oh. You see me too? Next thing you know, it's just like, pfft, that lion got to eat. It's on the hunt. Where's the biggest meal at? Where can I get fed? Need my belly full. My pockets fat. Boy, quick with it. Like a high five. Did I give you a salute? Just too quick with it. That's some A1 training. All right, here we go. Boom, boom, doom, 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 doom. These lionesses. They just walked over here like. Nice shit to hear. <laughs> get all the dollars. You can go over there to the other side. It's that time. We're switching. They just walked over there like, look at that. They about to get all the high in the meat. They about to get all the deer meat. All the gazelle. Look at that. They like, what? This is our corner. Let me just let y'all have it for a second. Uh oh, the other one over there like, you just stand there and you attract all of the attention toward us. We we'll let you get the scrapes, the leftovers. Now, it is a couple streets out here. You know what I mean? And like I say, it's tricky because most of the streets out here are dark. And it's like you got to really pull up on it to see like the quality. But I'm not going I'm not going to hold you. Some of these Model 3s could definitely be out here in Cybertruck Nation. You feel me? You know, I, I don't transfer these vehicles, so I couldn't tell them nothing. But, you know, I saw some potential out there. <laughs> I saw some potential. Look at this one. Deer caught in headlights. What I've noticed was it wasn't a lot of, let's say, action. You know what I mean? Like, what is this? Are you, are you morphing on me? Did you just, did you, are you turning into a Power Ranger? Is it morphing time? Oh, somebody must have told you to do this. Maybe the light reflects off of you or something. I'm not no spy camera. I can still see you. <laughs> but you see, look at this. This is the perfect example. You see how it just, ah. as soon as you hit the block, it's like no, no questions. Just head down, boy. You gotta be a, Gotta have an EMP out here to the disconnect them to their wires and they 
Wi-Fi networks so that they would be free minded. where I saw some some stuff like I said it's kind of dark out there so I really couldn't get the the whole you know like the the essence of what Holt Street is so obviously obviously we gotta come back and do a part two but this part right here I wanted to see exactly how much traffic is really pulled in from over here like is this like a I mean I see the quality I, I, I can see the merchandise clearly but is anybody actually partaking in the merchandise is anybody coming to purchase anything because remember nowadays I mean if you own them corners most of the time you you're either being punished or you're a renegade or you on some some brand new stuff or some out of town stuff i mean it's a few scenarios i don't want to let all the cats out the bag but again this is a perspective channel it's not really judging it's more so informative so if you're out there you need to know what you're getting into if you're not out there and you're thinking about it you want to have a good idea or you know hopefully to do scare you straight like look at you, you out there at all times of night you out there with there's no cape on you know what i mean so you gotta be your your own savior you don't see it ain't no no pick up a phone and call a, a cape immediately unless that cape was like right there when i say cape i mean savior you don't have to do it yourself because in those immediate situations you know what i mean the speed of a car is unmatched by the speed of a man Man can't match the speed of a car. It's just not possible. But the breakdown is just crazy because it was like, at least you would have saw something on the fig way. But it's all good. Thanks for watching. As always, I appreciate y'all. You already know, hop in them comments. Let me know what y'all think. And see you soon. Like, subscribe, comment, share.